There's been a progression in the craft beer market from traditional bottled beer and um, more recently more craft beer is going in cans which are traditionally this size but some of the more imaginative companies are looking at um, different uh, beer options and this uh, larger can size is, is very popular but also you can see that the people have really thought about the design here you know the generic aluminium can can be decorated a really high degree by using a clear on clear label which gives that impression of the printed can but of course without all the cost of you know the high run of buying a printed can so um, yeah we're seeing the the craft beer market develop in lots of different ways yeah, this is a company called Weird Beard. Um, they're very well known in the craft beer market and they almost come up with a different uh, brand a month and some of their designs are really, really good and they're very creative and uh, are doing very well. As you said, that's ideally suited to Absolutely, digital technology, yeah. isn't it? And you, and, and you uh, design every month, yeah. And uh, another company, um, uh, this one called Electric Bear, which is a Bristol brewer. Um, when we, they wanted stuff that really stood out with bold colours. They have a range of products, and uh, again, the domino strength is in producing big bold colours. Um, it's abrasion resistance and its UV stability is is perfect for this type of stuff. And uh, uh, Electric Bear have really gone from strength to strength. And it, it, on the shelf, these really stand out. Because of the craft market, it drives designs. It allows you to be original. So each individual beer has got a different recipe, it's got a different character, it's got a different boldness. Um, digital allows them, especially on the Domino, to match that quality. So each beer that they brew with a different batch number, we can match it. So they can have original artwork for that design. So what we did here, this is a like-for-like -like sample. This was printed flexographic. Um, the depth of the colour has changed, the blackness is a lot stronger. We've added um, a finish over the top to make it more coarse. Um, so it's little things like that, it's the exact same artwork. Yeah. But if you compare the two, the depth of it has changed. Yeah. Um, the quality of the print, the fine definition. Um, you said the colours are more striking. The colours, well. exactly. Yeah. So yeah. what they do is, a lot of them have a core range, mm. so they keep the designs the same mm. with little subtle differences like the colours here, for example. Um, one problem that they had here with Room Brewery was the depth of the colour with a Ferrari red. They mm. couldn't quite colour match it. Mm. Um, with the Domino, we have seven colours. We hit 90% of the colour gamut, you know, so we can get the colour on exactly spot on every single time. Mm.